It's day 31 in the 100 days challenge. We are still in Rosewood. My plan is to loot the rest of the houses that I haven't. Uh, and if that is not successful to find the how to use generators magazine, I'm going to set this place on fire. It is dark, bro. I might have to just wait for a little while. Does that light the room up? Yeah, a little bit. Oh, it's some bookshelves. Just hope these lawyers like generators. No. There is a lot of bookshelves in here. Ah, oh, you got me in the first half, bro. Just a stairwell. Right, let's go upstairs. to use generators. I can't believe I finally found it. Let's read this bitch right now. If I could emote, I'd be doing the orange justice right now. Ah, oh, thank God. We've got one final mission since we're in Rosewood, and that is to go to the prison. The Rosewood prison is one of the most notorious places in the game to get oh, guns and ammo and crash into lampposts. It also has thousands of zombies inside. So one of the main things that people don't realise about the, the armour in the prison is you don't actually need to go into the main body of the prison. There is thousands of zombies here, so you have to be careful. Um, even just driving up to the prison has given me flashbacks. Oh, what the fuck? There's the front door, though. What was this called, you zombies? Mark Whitfield, it's been a pleasure. That is how you died. Ditch the key and hop out here and take these zombies out quick. Just we've got like a sanitised area we can uh, work from. Let's try and clear this hall out first. Don't draw them all out. Whoever doesn't use machetes in this game is a loser. Look how effortless this is. Oh my god, there's so many in there. <laughs> oh, they're going to send out the top ropes, are they? I killed a thousand zombies yet. Yeah, buddy. Okay, you did the Uno reverse card, did you? And I can't hit you for some reason. There's nothing in these vending machines. Gigaos Chadamos is basically Michonne from The Walking Dead. We're in the armory. Let's go. Let's grab as much as we need.
we got everything we need. Let's just go to sleep before I mess up my uh, sleep pan. Now, this is the moment we've all been waiting for. Well, me anyway. All my crops are dead. But I can turn my generator on. Thank God, man. Lovely jubbly. I think my next plan of action is going to be harvest all of these crops, put them in the freezer and then uh, upgrade the base again because I just love building in this game, I can't help it. to be a farmer. devastated this uh, warehouse. Throw all the moodles there is possible.
Gosh. Hey. I've stayed in my base for days on end, literally like eight days straight building my base up. Um, I know we've got 13 gas canisters that we need to go and fill up at the uh, gas station, so we have fuel for pretty much ever. Hello there, friends. One full gas canister will fill the generator up to near enough about 100%, which lasts roughly nine and a half days. I've filled a total of 13 separate canisters up, so I've got enough fuel to last me well above 100 days at 124-ish. The only thing I've got to worry about is collecting electronic scrap just to repair the generator when the condition runs low. Right, I'm actually going to cut a huge chunk of this out because I've spent so much time building this. Um, but this is the new base layout. It's huge. So we've basically moved most of our storage over to this flat wall over here, which is more neat and tidy. We've got our armory, we've got our water station, we've got our food storage. And the way the food storage is set out is when you harvest from the farm, you put it into the freezer that's frozen. And then when you want to unfreeze it, you can drag it to the mini fridge. And then when you're hungry, you can just come up and eat a tomato. So we haven't actually done anything with this yet. I don't know what the plan is for it. We've got our bed, our furnace, some more storage, our TV. Let me come up to the roof and we've got our farm, which has just been replanted. We've got a generator, we've got enough fuel that's gonna last us plus 120 odd days. And we've got our rain catchers. I accidentally broke a couple when I was trying to disassemble them. If you enjoyed this video, please let me know down below. Like, sub, and click on the notification bell just so you get told every time I post. Most importantly, take it easy out there. Peace.